Standing behind the counter of Yuko Curry in downtown Los Angeles, Yuko Watanabe encouraged the hesitant customer to take a walk through her secret plant tunnel, an enchanting, Mawson plants covered stairway shaft that connects the ground floor of her restaurant to the second story loft. Go ahead. For nearly 14 years, Watanabe has brought her unique approach to Japanese comfort food and biofill and designed her three restaurants, Yuko Kitchen in the mid Wilshire neighborhood of Los Angeles, Yuko Curry in downtown L. A. and, a few doors down on 5th Street, Yuko Kitchen, DTLA. Overflowing with plants of every shape and size, pothos, ferns, rubber plants, Drusena fragrance lemon lime, you name it, and decorated with colorful hand-painted murals and chandeliers stripping with ferns, her favorite, and succulents, Watanabe's restaurants have become popular on Instagram. You never know what will happen when you plant a seed, but Watanabe's uncanny ability to fuse food with flora has secured Yuko Kitchen's reputation as a must-see Los Angeles destination, much like the plants that have overtaken her dining rooms and outdoor patios. Many people recognize Watanabe, even when she's wearing a mask, downtown dog walkers greet her on the sidewalk. Customers ask about her beloved 16-year-old German Shepherd, Genki. Recently, she was even spotted while shopping at Whole Foods. A girl came up to me and asked me if I'm Yuko from Yuko Kitchen. She said. She told me she follows me on Instagram and is a big fan of my restaurants. Watanabe, who was touched to hear that people love what she is doing, can't resist a touch of humility. I was just glad it happened at Whole Foods and not at a fast food joint while I am pigging out on greasy food, she added with a laugh. The past two years have been tough for restaurants and Watanabe in particular. When Los Angeles restaurants were forced to close indoor dining during the stay-at-home order, she struggled to keep her three restaurants afloat. Depressed by the sight of her empty tables, she decided to fill them with a profusion of plants. Nobody could come inside, she said of the restaurant closures, 